What's up everybody, welcome to week 43 of my Accutane adventures. Now we are in natural sunlight. Let me take an artificial light so you can see the difference in my face. Here's me in artificial light, very negative, cold, neutral lighting. Now you'll see a little bit of a difference. You can see some of the red marks on my face a little bit more, but what's really cool is this week, it's like I'm finally cleared. There's no, yeah, there's nothing I can think of. There's no actual cysts or zits or bumps that I can think of other than the blackheads. We're like this freaking close, guys. It's been long enough now that I think it'd be fun to look with retrospect back on the previous weeks that led up to now, which is week 44 from week one. So week one, I started and I was just so excited to start the Accutane finally because I had thought about it before and I even actually tried to start Accutane, but there was just so many problems. So I finally had started it and I was just so excited. The problem was I wasn't quite there yet when it came to video composure. I wasn't quite comfortable in front of the camera. You'll see right now. Welcome to my Accutane journey what this series will be is every Monday I'm gonna update you on how my progress is going on Accutane now fast forward seven weeks I'm getting a little bit more comfortable doing these types of videos so I was very comfortable with other videos but I hadn't quite done this kind of talk to you every week about something that's personal right now I had read before I started Accutane that the initial breakout from starting Accutane lasts about 8 to 12 weeks now what that means is that once you start the medicine your acne actually gets worse and starts getting aggravated then at that certain point when you finish with your initial breakout then it starts declining and getting better and better and more and clear but I was just about to get the eighth week mark and I was feeling so so much worse as far as how my face looked so I wasn't sure if my initial breakout was gonna be long or short or what because at seven weeks it was looking horrible now you guys know me I had to stay happy I had to stay positive because those are the only two ways that I know how to deal with such a negative part of your life now it was week 14 seven weeks after that at this point most people are done with their initial breakouts from what I had heard, most people had finished their breakouts from 10 to 12 weeks in and there's no problem, the initial breakout is done. But again, my face was still not cleared up. It had been another seven weeks and my face again was looking even worse than week seven. And I was like, huh, this is weird. Physically, my body is not following the same path that everyone else's body has followed when they took their cycles on Accutane. So at this point, my mind was full of confusion. I wasn't sure if the Accutane was working for me personally, if it was gonna be a very long course, if my body wasn't gonna accept it at all. I wasn't sure about anything yet, but I knew that I had to stay positive and I had to stay happy because there were so many people looking forward to my videos, so many people watching me and looking forward to me being positive and optimistic about my situation so that it could help them. And I didn't wanna let those people down. Skip on forward to week 19, five weeks later. Now I finally saw my face starting to clear up, starting to get a little bit better day by day instead of getting a little bit worse day by day. This meant that the initial breakout was over and I was so happy for it, so thankful for it because we had almost made it to five months in, 20 weeks in. And I was just, like I said, confused. I just wasn't sure if it was gonna work, when it was gonna kick in, what was gonna happen. So I was excited to see that it had just started working at 19 and I was excited to see what would happen over the course of the next few months. Okay, now it's week 27, we're eight weeks ahead of that 27 weeks in that's a pretty long course for most people they're finishing and by this point I was hoping that my face was you know on that road to never getting worse just getting better just getting more and more clear but on week 27 I had these two huge huge cysts on my forehead and it reminded me that when I say that you need to be patient on Accutane I really mean that you need to be patient on Accutane and I needed to take my own advice and just just accept it just relax breathe not worry about it and just push through that because my treatment is unlike that of a lot of other people you know not everyone has to go this long but you know some people do have to go this long so knowing that other people who were going to be going on Accutane for as long as I was or even longer I knew that I had to be patient I had to show how to deal with this horrible adverse thing with such a good positive outlook because I, I want to help people have a better outlook on life so I always have to demonstrate that myself because that's the best way to live. And now that brings us to where we are now. What we're doing is we're trying to clear up the blackheads and pretty much the last spot that we're trying to get them out of is my forehead. And we have some reoccurring zits that come up um, probably once a week. They'll come and they'll, they'll stay for about two days, then they'll leave. And then next week they'll come back again for a day or two and then they'll leave. So I think we're really working on just the polishing, finishing touches. Trying to get the blackheads out and trying to get those whiteheads to not come back weekly. So I was going through the comments of last week's video like I always do. And I saw this comment and I was just freaking out like a little fanboy because this girl has 800,000 subscribers. I don't know if you guys have ever seen her videos. She's super funny. But I was just like, what? 
it makes me feel like I'm doing something right when people who are so much bigger, so much more popular, so much more in this game are watching me and encouraging me and, and supporting me, being part of my team of support. That's that's immense. That's crazy. It's mind blowing to me. So thank you. Now MXKL brings up a good point. He wanted to know what happened with last week's Accutane. Now, if you guys didn't know this, um, last week for about two or three days from Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, so three days I didn't have Accutane. Basically they had made an appointment but then didn't hit me up on the phone to let me know when that appointment was so I missed my appointment and wasn't able to refill my prescription of Accutane when I was supposed to. So instead of running out of Accutane, what I did was I actually just tapered the Accutane. So instead of taking 100 milligrams a day, I actually just rationed it so I'd be able to make it until I could fill my prescription. So I was doing something like 80, 80, 60, 60, 60. Um, and no, I didn't see anything flare up, I didn't see anything get worse, and the reason why is because Accutane is fat soluble, so Accutane is in your body and it's stuck in there. It's not going anywhere for about two to four months after you take the, the last pill, so you don't really have to worry about it not working if you have to miss a dose or two, or if something like uh, what happened with me happened where you can't fill your prescription for a few days, maybe over the weekend, you're gonna be fine, you're gonna make it. It's gonna kinda suck that you have to stop taking your Accutane, but you're not gonna break out super bad, you're not gonna get worse. And a big shout out to Louise and a couple others because they left this comment after a couple people had asked the question, how do you get rid of dark spots, how do you manage spots on your face after you're done with your acne? Well, apparently what you do, and what a lot of people have said you should do, is you should put sunscreen on on those dark spots because apparently the sun will discolor your spots and then actually stop them from healing up if you're allowing the sun to continue hitting them. So sunscreen, I guess, is the absolute best way to get rid of dark spots, guys. All right, guys, that's the end of today's Accutane Adventure episode 44. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for helping me through this entire journey and helping me grow as a person, helping me grow through this issue that I'm dealing with, help me with everything. I'm about to go to the gym right after I edit this and I'm gonna read the comments right afterwards so please leave me love so I have something great to look forward to after my workout. Please like the video if you liked it, and please subscribe if you're not subscribed. Thank you guys so much. We're going to work on this until my face is completely 100% HBB clear. And until then, thank you guys for supporting me. Team Beyond the Week, lift heavy or die, my friend.